Hi, I am Kumoyun and today I am going to talk about Java FX desktop application development. So I am Java FX developer. Uh, within a couple of years, I am developing my own CRM system in Java FX and MySQL database. So today I am going to show my uh, SBD CRM project. It's kind of the Java FX desktop application, and nowadays a uh, couple of companies or couple of stores and other um, couple of stores are using it. So it's kind of commercial product too. But um, already I uploaded all the project source code to the GitHub, so you can use it. It's open source, you can share or you can sell whatever you want because I am really uh, interested in developing open source projects. So whenever someone uses my project or my code, I'm really happy uh, about this. So you can happily use and or whatever you want, it's your choice. So let's back to project. So let's run the project. This is SPD software business development and this is login page. Uh, I created this uh, logo uh, for my company. So I, I have a private company which is named ISBD. So the site is ISBD.us. You can visit and get your uh, knowledge about my company so here's a login page and it's kind of access uh, model uh, model development for example uh, it shows uh, the modules based on your username and password so let's choose first of all inventory page what is inventory? Inventory is kind of storing the products to the database and kind of uh, inventory management system. So here's, I, I'm developing this uh, CRM system in two languages. One is English and one is Uzbek. So this is Uzbek version for Uzbek market. So here's a it's a type you can cry, create the custom types for, you, for your needs for example fruits and drinks or anything you want this is suppliers you can create supplier supplier name supplier bank account su supplier phone number and additional for information uh, adding uh, update and delete functions his invoice you can this is I, I think this is really convenient for kind of wholesale markets for example invoice you can add invoices from foreign countries or uh, importing or exporting something like this you can choose uh, the invoice name and the company this uh, Akpa or the my name is whatever you want. You can choose the um, currency and you can type the sum or you can choose uh, the date and the add button. So and you can yeah you can see your invoice list and you can if you type if you click this row. In this table you can see the added products in this invoice here and the maximum maximum uh, the amount and uh, the cost so here's the invoice log uh, you can uh, store your invoice history and get report and export to Excel example I choose uh, Aqua and here's a report and you can export to Excel and you can generate the PDF files 
uh, export this table to Excel and you can choose the uh, exporting path for your Excel for example I choose desktop and select the successfully um, <coughs> choose pass and then here is a adding product page for example this and barcode generate you can generate the barcode with uh, manual or generate automatically and choose um, type and name apple and uh, quantity 100 and 10 dollars for example and add is your uh, product um, barcode name or um, you can filter your products and of course quantity and cost is a transformation page you can send the inventory products to the sales department so what is sales department let's uh, back to sales department for example four and four and open sales department it's kind of big module um, it's um, kind of post system for example let's generate the items here you can choose the types and when you click the types uh, this table shows and the products which is included in these types and in this type two products and in this type one product and let's sell something uh, when you click this it automatically inserts the product to the uh, this uh, table and you can choose the currency and price and of course quantity and automatically uh, calculates the sum of this product cost for example another item and again and the sum the quality and this is kind of uh, calculation total calculation for example you can add the items from here too barcode for example type this one two 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 and press enter and it adds the product to the table so this is 10 and the total cost is 2 million 700 zooms for example let's sell and let's choose the the customer is a his customer and his customer's balance um, and uh, uh, let's sell it sell so it automatically the subtracts the sailed items quantity from the inventory table let's sell it so this is a history of sailed sold items and this is kind of functionality too if you want to really interested in in my project you can visit my website or check github page you can download and use whatever you want okay let's save the time and this is my project uh, if you want to use it you can use it's free and open source thank you for your attention it's humayun from uzbekistan